Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation. Through your goodness we have this bread to offer, which earth is given and human hands have made. It will become for us the bread of life. By the mystery of this water and wine, may we come to share in the divinity of Christ, who humbled himself to share in our humanity. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation. Through your goodness we have this wine to offer, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Lord God, be pleased to receive us and accept the sacrifice we offer you with humble and contrite hearts. Lord, wash away my iniquities and cleanse me of all my sins. Pray that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Father Almighty. Lord, accept the gifts we present in memory of St. Mary Magdalene. Her loving worship was accepted by your Son, who is Lord forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. Lift up your hearts. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. Father, all powerful and ever living God, we do well always and everywhere to give you thanks. You are glorified in your saints, for their glory is the crowning of your gifts. In their lives on earth, you give us an example. In our communion with them, you give us their friendship. In their prayer for the church, you give us strength and protection. This great company of witnesses spurs us on to victory to share their prize of everlasting glory through Jesus Christ, our Lord. With angels and archangels and the whole company of saints, we sing our unending hymn of praise. We come to you, Father, with praise and thanksgiving through Jesus Christ, your Son. Through him we ask you to accept and bless these gifts we offer you in sacrifice. We offer them for your holy Catholic Church. Watch over it, Lord, and guide it, granted peace and unity throughout the world. We offer them for Benedict, our Pope, for me, your unworthy servant, and for all who hold and teach the Catholic faith that comes to us from the Apostles. Remember, Lord, your people, especially those for whom we now pray. Remember all of us gathered here before you. You know how firmly we believe in you and dedicate ourselves to you. We offer you this sacrifice of praise for ourselves and those who are dear to us. We pray to you, our living and true God, for our well-being and redemption. In union with the whole church, we honor Mary, the ever-Virgin Mother of Jesus Christ, our Lord and God. We honor Joseph, her husband, the apostles and martyrs, Peter and Paul, Andrew, James, John, Thomas, James, Philip, Bartholomew, Matthew, Simon, and Jude. We honor Linus, Cletus, Clement, Sixtus, Cornelius, Cyprian, Lawrence, Chrysogonus, John and Paul, Cosmos and Damien, and all the saints. May their merits and prayers gain us your constant help and protection. Father, accept this offering from your whole family. Grant us your peace in this life. Save us from final damnation and count us among those you have chosen. 
Bless and approve our offering. Make it acceptable to you, an offering in spirit and in truth. Let it become for us the body and blood of Jesus Christ, your only Son, our Lord. The day before he suffered, he took bread in his sacred hands. Looking up to heaven, to you, his almighty Father, he gave you thanks and praise. He broke the bread, gave it to his disciples and said, Take this, all of you, and eat it. This is my body, which will be given up for you. When supper was ended, he took the cup. Again, he gave you thanks and praise, gave the cup to his disciples and said, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. This is the cup of my blood the blood of the new and everlasting covenant. It will be shed for you and for all so that sins may be forgiven. Do this in memory of me. Let us proclaim the mystery of faith. 